Good morning, everyone. Uh, John for Popeye's Postcards. Uh, I warn you right now, this is going to be a very unenthusiastic uh, wet sold video. Uh, trying to transition from Hawaii time to East Coast time uh, is kicking my ass. Uh, that six hours time difference is just no joke. I am exhausted. And as you can see, I had really, really crappy sales on, uh, on eBay. Um, I think it was a mistake. It was the first time in, geez, 12 plus years that, uh, I completely shut down the store. Uh, I may have never have done it, but I think it was a mistake hiding everything. I think I, you know, lost a lot of traction in the search, uh, metrics. Uh, so I'll try a couple things. Again, I haven't li listed anything for quite a while. Um, but I may try to do an end and relist. I usually only do that at the three or four month mark. I may try that at, at the month and a half mark. See if that will hopefully um, kickstart the sales again. But yeah, I, I think it was uh, a mistake to actually hide everything. So, um, but I didn't want to do, you know, two week handling time. I just, I didn't want to do that. Um, and then if those things don't work, uh, listing more and, and then relist, then I guess I have to admit that, uh, I might have to go in and add item specifics. I don't want to admit that, but, uh, that could be uh, an issue also. So let's go ahead and, um, get into the what sold part of this. As you can see, only 11 orders, uh, only 54 bucks. Um, so not, not very good at all. First one, Alfred Man's ear. Anthropomorphic dressed cats, kittens, hospital, nurse. Looks like I had two of these. Uh, printed in Belgium. Uh, $6 on a best offer. Grants, New Mexico. Franciscan Lodge Motel Route 66. Has a big old crease in there. And I accepted a best offer of $6. Next is circa 1935, the Marine Corps Hymn, uh, California uh, Pack Expo. So there's that. I've had several of these, and that's about $14.99. Uh, that's about what they sell for. That's a pretty good sale there. Uh, next we have uh, Hornellsville, New York, Opera House, Glitter, Mica Pre-1908. So I always try to note that it has this uh, glitter mica stuff glued to the front, uh, just in case people don't look real close in the picture and then see when they get it, they see the, the stuff on there. That was $12.99. Next, Riverhead, in, uh, New York. This is on Long Island, Water Tower, and whatever, uh, part 1905. That well, looks like it went to Germany. Hmm, interesting. Uh, Six dollars on that. Military, romantic, sailors, and women tug of war pool for something. Um, it says 1940, but this is uh, postmark 1940. But this is definitely a circa 1912 or so postcard. Four dollars best offer. Easton, Pennsylvania, aerial view of Center Square. I have a whole bunch of these. And that sold for $2.99. Next is uh, Gallup, New Mexico, Indian Capital, Inner Tribal, Colorful Statue, Route 66. And that sold for $6.99. Then New Susquehanna River Bridge. Hava de Grace, Maryland, and Perryville, Maryland. And that sold for $476. Yeah, $476. Uh, next is Kingsport, Tennessee, circa 1950s, Broad Street View, stores and cars. There's the street view, $699 for this card. Next is uh, North Jackson, Ohio, Dolly Madison. Motel interior vintage linen. So uh, that's it. Uh, Six ninety nine, and I've only sold a couple post uh, airline postcards since I've been back. I did the same thing, hid that store, 
Um, and again, I think that, uh, that's an issue. So don't recommend doing that anymore. I won't be going on a two week vacation anytime in the near future either. So I don't see that as an issue. I uh, want to talk about, um, you ever get these? Hate when that happens. When you get a, a postcard with a little yellow sticker says it was undeliverable. And uh, this one, uh, I looked up the guy's name and eBay had no record of me selling to him. Uh, and I searched by item number. I'm sorry, item uh, the postcard itself couldn't find it here. I sent this out in January and I just got this back yesterday. And um, luckily the guys, uh, he put his, I couldn't find a listing or a, a good telephone number or email. Um, he did, I'm sorry, he did put a, his company name on where to ship to. And uh, so I was able to find him through LinkedIn. Uh, sent an email and it was immediately returned. Uh, mail or demon or whatever that was then I did a little bit re more research and I found an obituary for the guy at least I thought it was a guy um, but the company that he owns is still operational and uh, I called this morning and the guy's alive and here he gave me the wrong address um, I have to set it to a PO box and not the main street uh, or the physical street address so it's going back out Today, I wanted to make sure I, I didn't find any place that he uh, opened a re, uh, item not received case and doesn't look like I did any type of refund to him, but I always want to make sure that they get their card that they paid for. Just curious if you've ever come across uh, getting cards back, the, the people have died, uh, what do you do? Um, I've had it had a couple times. Uh, I didn't know what to do. Uh, there was no way I could really refund the money. Um, so I don't know what, all, what you think it would be nice if eBay had some, some mechanism to somehow return the money, uh, or where it would go to if it's in a state. I don't know. I know I'm rambling about that, but, uh, just curious if you all have had that. So I got to make sure that goes back out, uh, today. Uh, let's talk about what not real quick. I got my final approval, uh, last night to sell. So uh, you can go to whatnot.com or click on the link below. Again, you get $10 for uh, uh, your, off your first purchase if you're a new uh, customer. Uh, looks like I will do my best to do my first live show on Tuesday, May 3rd. Still working out. Um, today, I've, I started this morning gathering some lots together, and I got to get all that inputted into whatnot but uh there'll be a link uh in the video or i'll put a link somewhere that uh, you can you'll be able to go directly to my live so i'll have giveaways um just come on in uh if you don't buy anything you can still enter follow me and enter uh for a free giveaway i'll have several of those um and i need your if you have any topic requests you know if you want i don't know 50 Disney cards, if you want 25 outhouse cards, if you want holidays, someone said they want holidays, I will get uh, uh, some lots of holidays together. And if there's any uh, places, you know, cities, I, I probably couldn't, you know, do anything smaller than like, you know, big cities, Pittsburgh, New York, Philly, stuff like that, California, big cities, uh, any state requests, stuff like that. And uh, the only other thing, I'm working on uh, setting up an interview uh, with someone I think you all be excited to. I'm not, it's not 100% confirmed yet. He's, uh, he's agreed that it would be good to do an interview. Um, I have to wait until mid-May and we'll talk again. So hopefully maybe toward the end of May, beginning of June, I'm going to have an interview with... Uh, with someone I just I know I'm teasing it but I'm pretty excited to I hope it works out because I'm uh, I've been an admirer of this person for a while and um, hopefully I can bring him on and and we can we can have a chat so again I apologize I'm I'm exhausted I uh, hope your sales are excellent and hope your day is even better Ooh.
very motivational. Have a great day.